Let's go back to this play from the 2018 playoffs that the Cavs like to run for Kevin Love. Let's look at that again. The ball is entered to LeBron James at the elbow and George Hill goes to set a screen for Kevin Love. The Cavs know that NBA teams generally don't want to switch smaller players onto bigger players or bigger players onto smaller players because of the two mismatches it creates in favor of the offense. As a result, the defenders, in this case Van Vliet and Valanciunas, hesitate to switch and instead play their man tight. Love is therefore able to blow by Valanciunas for a layup since Valanciunas is overplaying Love to avoid the switch. Now watch the same play against Golden State. Let's see that again. The ball is entered to LeBron James at the elbow and J.R. Smith goes to set a screen for Kevin Love. Again, the defenders overplay Love and J.R. because Curry doesn't want to switch onto Love and Bell doesn't want to switch onto J.R. So Kevin Love backdoors them. Notice how Draymond Green seems to know where Kevin Love is going. He knows where LeBron wants to throw the ball. He knows the play. So he goes to stand in Love's way and blocks the passing lane. LeBron James realizes this, so he makes eye contact with Draymond Green's man Tristan Thompson for a screen knowing that Draymond is committed down at the baseline. See how far Draymond is from his man Thompson? Kevin Durant has no idea he expects Draymond to be there. KD gets rubbed off on the screen and LeBron James knows he's getting an open shot. LeBron wins the possession. The Cavs run the same play on the following possession. Did you see that? Let's go back. Again, it's J.R. Smith setting a screen for Kevin Love. Let's see what Draymond does. He lunged. He lunged himself into the passing lane to block the pass, but this time he doesn't commit completely to the baseline. Look at his feet there at the top of the key this time. He fakes his commitment and tries to bait LeBron into attempting the same jump shot on the right side again. This time Green is waiting to sprint over to contest that shot but LeBron tricks him instead. LeBron expected Draymond to expect LeBron to attempt the jump shot on the right side again. So instead, he fakes going right and rejects the screen. KD and Draymond expected LeBron to go right. By going left, he leaves them a step behind. Draymond is now far away from the basket and Jordan Bell is forced to recover and foul. The Cavs get two free throws. LeBron wins the possession.